will consist of ceremony for the memorabilia presentation to be presided by His Excellency Privy Council. On behalf of Siam University, as the host of British Event Dialogue, thank you again for our guests, commentators of the university and industry, participants, faculty members, and students for joining this event today. And especially on this special event of the 50th anniversary celebration of Siam University. The university has granted the special Siam Award to Nobel laureate Finn Erling Kipton for his noble academic work and also visiting Siam University for the delivery this special lecture today. Thank you very much. Welcome to the Japan ASEAN Bridges event series, which is facilitated by the Vienna based International Peace Foundation. Commemorating the 50th anniversary of official relations between Japan and the ASEAN region. Riches has been continuously held in Thailand and Japan since November last year, involving the participation of Nobel laureates for physics, chemistry, medicine, and economics. Hello, everyone, and thank you for inviting me to this event. Um, I especially am uh, grateful to Uwe Morwitz, who helped to facilitate my visit. Same for these other uh, pictures, Italy, Portugal, and Ireland. Uh, what's dramatic about the picture for Spain, but also for Italy and Portugal, is that growth came to a full stop. Starting about 1990, growth came to a full stop. Peace promotes trade, as in the example of the uh, uh, in the example of the uh, tradable goods sector. Uh, peace was very powerful in promoting uh, trade. Professor Kidland introduced different contacts from various parts of the world that I used as illustration. This showed us significant differences in what has evolved across nations in recent years. I have to interrupt you know, this panel session because we are late on the schedule. Thank you for your participation and uh, for your time. Thank you. Thank you, Professor. On behalf of the University, I extend our profile gratitude to Professor Kitlin and commentators for sharing your wisdom and insights with us. Your lecture has inspired students, faculty, and guests alike, enriching our academic community pursuit of knowledge and understanding in economics, policy, business, social science, and applied fields. Special thanks to International Peace Foundation and the organizing committee for making this event possible. And thank you everyone who participated in today's event for engaging in this important conversation. Thank you.